What's happening guys, welcome back to another video. Take a nice little seat here. This is Phil, by the way. Everyone say, Phil, say hello, bro. Hello, how you doing? Hello. We actually met, right, because he comes to for training all the time. There's a lot more than meets the eye with Phil, you know. I'm probably gonna base this vlog around here, right, because at the end of the day, these vlogs, I want them to also help people be a place to go to for, I don't know, a bit of entertainment, maybe with feeling a bit shitty. A bit more motivation, you know, get yourself into the gym and things like that as well. Um, if you don't know quite what you're doing, maybe get a little couple of tips and, exercise routines, whatever, from things I do with my clients in the day. My clients are normal people, they're not people that live in the gym. They can do it and then get in shape and then come to the gym, they can work out, so can you. Now, there's a big stigma around mental health at the moment, right? A lot more people are coming out with it, a lot more people have got it, understanding what it is. Phil, if you don't mind me saying it, I'm sure you don't. Tell them what you got, man. Uh, so I suffer with mac depression, anxiety, uh, and suicidal tendencies is like the main three things I have. I've got other things as well, but they're like the three things that I think a lot of people will deal with as well. So yeah, they're the three things I really sort of suffer with. So obviously in, uh, in your life, right, there's, lots of, there's lots of ups and downs. One thing he's made a valid point of more than once is how training, training has helped him. Helps him deal with it, right? I think when it comes to training, it's a mindset. It's a mentality you need to be in. And uh, training kind of, there's a lot of life analogies when it comes down to training. And you can learn a lot about life through it and what it pushes you through and puts you through. If anyone is going through this right now, you know you've got depression, anxiety and things like that. I want to get a couple of words from Phil just about how training has helped him. How it makes him feel, the mind it puts him in, how, you know, how he deals with it, when he's going through those, when he comes to the gym, what he's thinking, his thought processes and things like that. So my question to you, Willa. How is training helping you deal with your problems? The main thing like, that's helped me with it is like when I first started I was really self-conscious about coming to the gym, working out because people watch you but honestly don't care just get in there, get it done because the pump you get on is better like I'm not a big lad, the pump you get on is amazing you feel so much better and every single day you come in you're getting it done and you're one step closer to being better and like I've got it Sure, people in this gym have got it as well. Even if you just jump in with someone and go, oh, can I just jump in with you? The, the tips and tricks you'll like, pick up is amazing and you'll just feel better because you'll be doing stuff, you'll be working out. And it's all a mindset. Every single day, get up, get it done, keep grinding. You're one step closer to being free from your illness and free from your, suicide, free from your mental health issues. That's the main thing. As soon as you're working, you're getting one step closer to being free from it. And just, yeah, get up, get it done, smash it out. You can do it. You can do it. There it is. It's a mindset. You need to just uh, trust yourself, trust the process, get into the gym. You know, even if you're not a big gym person, just get in there, do something. It, honestly, that the walking into that gym and progressing and doing something, it kind of just changes the way you think and your thought process and all that. So there it is from the man himself. Been through a lot, man. He still turns up. That's the most important thing. He just turns up. Gets get it done. It done. There it get is. It done. So, yeah. done. so we're about to hit a nice, testy little. Testy? Tasty. Little push session. Soph maybe joining us. Soph is one of the trainers in here as well. Not Soph my fiance, Soph the trainer. <laughs> Let's go and get into it. You had your breakfast bro? Always, two breakfast. Get two up, breakfast. first breakfast. One get stuff big done. bulk coming now, yeah? Yeah boy. Big strong boy, that's what we want. <laughs> For lunch, we're gonna go out and leave the big camera here. We'll switch into the phone in three, two, one. All right, so lunch done. Now we come for a quick coffee with Soph. Back to the gym in five minutes. Two clients and train together, new one, so I might not get them on the camera. 
but I'll talk to you after that. Alright, so I came back, I've trained Ahmed and Jonathan. I'm not gonna get them on the vlog straight away. I get them into a couple of sessions and then I explain to them about the channel and then I kind of bring it into them from there. So next one up anyway, we've all seen him plenty of times, Mr. Jampiero, jams baby. Full session, three, two, one. Jams is gone, you all remember Kerry, she's been in many vlogs before. Give a little wave to the camera. We're gonna do a little full body. Let's go. Yes, Karen, baby! Yes, mate. Oh, I miss you today, where have you been? Man, just doing some stuff. What stuff? You know, the men's stuff. Oh, tell, tell men's stuff. Mm -hmm. Oh, I won't go into then. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, that is Kerry done. I'm just gonna chill with my man, Ken, for five minutes. You all know Ken. I got one left, I got Matthew, he's coming in now. And then I'm going to my mother's. I'm gonna go see some beagles in this vlog today. That's all. There you go. BD exit from the gym. I'm gonna go meet my grandmother. You're all gonna see my grandmother for the first time. I oh, know she's been on once, but I'm gonna go see her now. Then go to my mother's. Hello! <laughs> Anna, we're getting a Domino's. How do you feel about Domino's? <laughs> Lovely. Lovely. <laughs> oh, Give us your views on life. Lovely. <laughs> Everything's lovely. Lovely, yeah. Zoeys! Oh, 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 Ooh, okay guys, so I'm home. So as you've seen, obviously I took my nan for pizza, we went to Domino's and uh, I don't think she eats pizza very often, but she, she old man. <laughs> uh, we took her back to my mother's, went to see my mother and we just had a chill night there. It was about 20 past 10, so I stayed there a good few hours. Point in this vlog now, obviously I, I've train clients tonight throughout the day that haven't been in this vlog obviously I'm not gonna get every single one of them on because not everyone wants to be in a video right each their own the main point of this as you saw at the beginning of the video I wanted this this video to be a place to where you can watch videos it's gonna help motivate you it's gonna help get you in the gym it's gonna help inspire you and you know if you're struggling with things like mental health training can just is a, is a great tool to help you focus and kind of better things uh, that's going on in your life right there so you can focus a little bit better um, a lot of my clients do have mental health issues and every single one of them there is a common pattern in there which uh, training helps them if you are struggling with anything like that think about joining a gym just make that first step anyway guys if you are liking these videos smash that like button don't forget to subscribe and i'll catch you on the next video peace hey man don't forget to subscribe to ricardo you're gonna make all kinds of games all kinds yeah, i'm right yeah. i'm right <laughs>